Hey guys, welcome back to the Quiet Village of Berg here on episode 3.5 of Lunar Sword Star Story Complete on the RPG Tour Guide channel. Yeah, that's, uh, hmm. So, I made a mistake. <laughs> we are back here in an earlier save back in Berg because I wanted to show this off and I didn't want to wait until, until any later than we already have here because there's a person that I forgot to talk to during the course of the Let's Tour. Which is important in the whole uh, Bromide side quest, which we need to talk to somebody up here in the upper floor of the weapons shop with Ramus in our party there. So this can be done at any point after Ramus joins your party until you leave for Moribia there. Like I was able to come back here uh, when Nash joins the party and so this guy talk, talk to this guy and get the same scene. So that is, so that is the window of uh, points of time that you want to talk to this guy. I didn't know for the longest time that this was part of the Bromide side quest. Uh, I guess that was just something that I d did on my own there, because like, if, if I were playing by myself there, I would talk to literally everybody <laughs> all the time there, because I love the dialogue in this game there, and <laughs> I love the little scenes that they do, but uh, for the sake of the Let's Tour, I was trying to hurry things along there, and it didn't talk to literally everybody, <laughs> so that's why we missed this scene. And I wanted to go ahead and jump back into this uh, there, so this is going to be put in the playlist just right after episode 3, right after the uh, Dragon Trial is done and over with. So you come back here, uh, well, like I said there, any time that Ramus is in your party, you come up here and talk to this guy here. It was, at last, it's you! Remember the golden egg you sold me yesterday, Ramus? Strange how it had a perfectly ordinary yolk inside when I dropped it on the floor. I want my money back, now! <laughs> uh, the y yoke was golden, wasn't it? Enough with your humor, wise guy. Where's my money? Uh, I'm sorry about this, Alex, but could you lend me 30 silver? Thanks for nothing, Ramus. And with that, we lose 30 silver there, so... You know, funny scene all on its own there, but this 30 silver comes back into play later on in Ramus's shop there, where he... Uh, at the very end of the game, there's so something at the very beginning of the game influences something at the very end of the game <laughs> will allow you to buy two of the Bromides. So that's why I wanted to jump back to this point there where we could loan this money to Ramus. I will continue the, the tour from the original save file there so we can see. <laughs> there's a different dialogue if we go through without this scene happening. So it's something of interest there. So that's why I'm going to continue with that there. And I'm going to play through this on my own as a way of getting footage because there is going to be a uh, spoiler there I guess <laughs> there's going to be a speedy tour of how to get all the Brahmas there because there is uh, definitely some tricky points to it there like this one obviously <laughs> so I'm gonna be doing a whole speedy tour with a guide on how exactly you want to get all the Brahmas there if you want that's the uh, sort of hundred percent completion of this game here if I ever catch you trying to con someone again consider yourself busted in advance yeah, it's a nice little, a nice little character moment for Ramus there. You get to learn that, like, yeah, Ramus is kind of a little schemer on his own there, a little bit of a comment, if you will. There it adds a little bit more depth to the interaction between him and Brett, uh, where uh, you know the team is sc scammed out of their money and everything there. So yeah, just a little nice character moment there, and uh, a moment that you have to have if you want to get all the Bromides. So I'm going to do my best to point out these points in the game here because there are. A couple other low points where talking to certain people unlock those points in the in the side quest there like uh, I don't think I mentioned it in the video there I'm gonna go back and comment on the video where we meet Facia uh, if you talk to her assistant uh, we could go back now and talk to her assistant I do believe there leave the trial or after the trial we could go back and talk to her assistant still and to get the dialogue with her we did talk to her there so that I do believe that that's another trigger for a another bromide so uh, yeah, I'm going to do better about uh, pointing all those out and do better about definitely showing them off. i got better notes now uh, for all those little little pieces of information. Like I said there, this this scene in particular here isn't even in like the official uh, Lunar Source of Storage Strategy Guide. So it's something <laughs> a little bit annoying in that fact there because like there are multiple guides that leave this out and then like half of them do put this in there. So that's why I went back to double check and yes this does seem to be a requirement for getting all the bromides so that's why I'm making this video there uh 
rambling a little bit too long there for this. It's supposed to be a really short video, but still. <laughs> so yes, uh, be on the lookout for a speedy tour for getting all the Brahmides in this game there, and uh, be on the lookout for more of the regular walkthrough. <laughs> I'll see you guys in that there. Take care, guys. All right, everyone. That will bring this episode of Lunar the Silver Star Story complete to a close. You can rest up at the nearest Goddess Altina statue, but don't stray too far from the bus. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll know when the next episode goes up. Until that time comes, stay gold, my friends.